The dubs. Wow, pushing the oh, to seven. The Splash Brothers, you know I love you. Mm. All right, maybe next year. <laughs> oh, and speaking of the dubs, it kind of reminds me of other things going on around the league. Yes. What about all the coaching changes? The playoffs have been great on the floor, but now we're talking about stuff on the bench that's happening and all the coaching carousel. Remember last year, 13 brand new head coaches. Now these other jobs opening up. What do you think about that? It's a head scratcher because a lot of these coaches have won 50 plus games. Teams have gotten better, have gotten into the playoffs. And you ask yourself, what are these GMs got to do now? Normally you're looking for free agents, trying to make your team better. Now you got to find the right coach to be the better leader. I wonder uh, which announcer is going to get which job. Ooh. It's going to be real interesting. That's going to be very interesting. All right, let's talk MVP. We love those three letters. Yes, we do. But in the playoffs, it's a little different. I'm thinking about most valuable performance. Ah, which, performance. Which games stand out to you so far in the playoffs? So not players, performance. No, but most valuable performance. performance. I got to go with LaMarcus Aldridge. Wow. 46, then backs it up with 43. I guess in the Houston Rockets series, so you're going like on fire. The first one was a show. The second one was an encore. You're combining I'm them I'm combining together. the two because the first one we said, we know he can play. We know he's gotten better. We know he's an all-star this year. But can he do it again? Can he carry his team out of the, that series?